number seven and Frankie is pounding the nails in that were driven with the air nailer earlier today period. It's almost five o'clock and he's just about finished period. I thought I'd do a quick video of what we got done. We did all the sheathing on this side. Uh, actually, that was the last thing that we did. Minus this piece. You can see the lighter colored pieces, the last three. These are the three pieces of sheathing that I have left today. So at the moment, I don't have any plywood left for putting up sheathing. This morning we started, we started by hanging the rest of the sheathing on the back side. And then once we were done, we went around the corner, we put up some scaffolding so we could actually get to it. And we put in all the sheathing on this side as well. This is all done and all nailed off. So now we can take this double truss that's right here and push it over against the wall. Hopefully you can hear me with all the nailing that's going on. So this is the inside of the garage. As you can see, the only plywood that remains is actually the roof sheathing that I picked up in advance so that we could get started. When we were ready to get started, we had material. So this gives us an idea from our carport how big this building looks. It does look huge, but once we have windows put in place, uh, the roof is on and the windows and trusses where Frankie is standing, once those trusses are put on with the four foot overhang in front, I think the building won't look quite as big. Right now it looks like a church.